Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys my October slash fall favorites. I have some beauty items, I have some lifestyle items, some fashion items. So if you are new to my channel, I would absolutely love it if you subscribe and please like. Now let's go ahead and get started. So let me go ahead and start with all the beauty products. It's not too many. So I'm gonna go ahead and start off with actually the color that I'm wearing on my lips right now. This is the Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick and it's in the color Gingerbread. You'll you won't miss it. It's got little gingerbread men on the top. It's so cute. It smells so good and it's not drying on the lips. I think it's a really nice fall color. It's perfect for like Thanksgiving and just this time of the year. Isn't that gorgeous? Really, really like this. Another thing that I've been liking is the Jeffree Star Liquid Frost. Now that the holidays are around the corner, I think um, I always like to wear glitter. I love sparkle. I just love any sparkle that's in my life, whether it's makeup, whether it's on my body, whether it's diamonds, anything. I love sparkle. What girl doesn't? So this is really, really nice. It's like you can apply this pretty much anywhere. You can wear it as a highlight. You can wear it on your arms. You can wear it on your chest. You can wear it on your legs. Anywhere that you want a little bit of glow. This is really, really nice. It's very, it's very soft. It's not chunky glitter. It's just a little bit of sparkle. Very, very sheer. Really, really nice. And I got mine in the color goddess it's just like a gold soft uh, glitter really really like it. i i think this is this will actually be really nice for the summertime too but it's also great for the holidays another item that i actually that i'm pretty new with um is the taja silk primer and um i started using this maybe about a month and a half ago and I really like it. I think it's going to be really good, especially now that it's starting to get a little bit cooler here. It's really hydrating. Um, I don't know if you guys want to see that. It's all picked in. The only thing that I can say that I don't like, I don't like the form of applying it, having to, you know, scrape it and apply it to your face. That's the only thing, but nonetheless, this is a really good primer. It, it makes your face look really, really flawless. I don't use this on the day to day, uh, basis but i do like it um if i you know just i don't know special days i guess because <laughs> it is pretty expensive but it is a great primer it makes makeup stay longer it makes your skin look flawless and i feel like it's really hydrating um, another beauty item is the cover effects foundation and it's actually like this and i really like this when i want extra coverage i don't use this as just my foundation alone i usually wear the nars radiant um, flawless foundation i wear that one and then if i want extra coverage like on days that i'm going out i will get my my beauty blender and just dap it in there and apply it to my face like that and i just feel like if you know if i do want to hide the freckles that i have this is perfect i don't need to put concealer on it just makes your face look so 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 flawless perfect it looks like you have just absolutely perfect skin so i really really do like it i'm sure you could use it as a foundation all over your face i just like it for more you know in the, like the center of my face where i have my freckles my redness any acne scars that's what i use it for but really really like the cover effects uh, foundation and i get mine in the color g50 now another item that i've really been liking it's actually something new I'm taking it out of the package I bought too, is the Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. Now, I've been using the Beauty Blender for so many years, and I really, really like it. And I know it's actually this uh, sponge has been talked a lot about here on YouTube, so I wanted to try it out. And oh my God, you guys, I really, really like it. I use mine damp. I wet it a little bit, and um, it gives more of a sheer coverage, but you can use it dry for more of a full coverage. And this thing, when it's wet, it's huge. Like You can apply your foundation super, super quickly. I really, really like this. And I think it was like for the two pack, I think it was $10. The beauty blender is like 20 something dollars. So basically it's $5 and I like it. I like it so much more than the beauty blender. So bye beauty blender. <laughs> I'm using the real techniques for now. Now moving along, um, I'm going to go ahead and talk about this. Uh, it's called the Chopsticks Total Hydration Lip Scrub. I picked this up at Target. I'm sure you can pretty much get it anywhere. It was no more than like three or four dollars. So what it is, it's a lip scrub. My lips, uh, because I do wear a lot of like liquid lipstick, sometimes some of the ones that I do wear are really drying on my lips. Nobody wants crusty lips, especially now with the colder months ahead of us, a lot of us will get chapped lips. And this scrub, it smells like peppermint for one. And for another one, it's really, really gentle on exfoliating your lips. I use this maybe like two, three times a week, or if I, you know, if I want to wear like a, a red lip or something that you know shows your flaws more i will definitely use this i really really like it and um i really recommend it it's a chapsticks total hydration lip scrub 
talking about lips, I'm gonna um, talk. I'm gonna tell you guys about the the. This is what I use on the everyday basis. This is the Aquaphor. Um, what is this? Lip repair ointment. I use this every day. I carry. I have one of these everywhere. I have one in my car, my husband's car, in my purse, in my makeup box. I have one in the bathroom. I have these everywhere. I love these. And I also recently been reaching out for the Aquaphor um, ointment. Recently, we were all sick in my house. We all had really bad colds. So all of us had like chapped lips, redness under our nose. Our nose was peeling just from the constant, you know, rubbing our noses with uh, Kleenex and whatnot. And this stuff works so good. I actually was using this on my lips um, instead of this because they were so, so, so dried out. And this stuff is amazing. Um, I also get a lot of like dryness on my hands and this has been really, really good. So I really, really recommend it. It's super cheap. You can find it anywhere. And it's good to have this on hand because like I said, colder months are ahead and who doesn't get dry skin? So now this i think i'm pretty much done with my beauty products now this is just going to be um one of my favorite candles that i want to talk to you guys about it is the cranberry woods candle i don't like anything too perfumey too strong but this candle smells so so good it's one of my favorites i think it's perfect for fall it's good for even like the the winter months i really really like this candle um it says that the fragrance notes are tart cranberry, cinnamon bark, forest cedar, and golden amber. It's a really nice uh, candle. It's a really nice scent. I, I light one up in my kitchen, and that scent goes all through my house. It I, you know goes in my living room, my, my kitchen, even in the bedroom, so you can smell it. I really, really like it. It's from Bath & Body Works. I love candles. You can always walk into my house and be guaranteed a candle is burning. And recently, I've been really loving this one. Now, let me see. Let me talk to you guys about these cups. I'm not sure if you guys, I'm sure everybody has heard about them. They're the Yeti cups. Guys, I absolutely love these cups. If you're a person that struggles with drinking water, this, I promise, will help you. My husband and I carry these everywhere, everywhere we go. We are we are always on the road because of our work, and we just put ice in this early in the morning, stick a lemon wedge in there, and we take water bottles on the go with us and fill it up. And by the time we get home, hours later, we still have ice in our cup. And same thing for the hot one, like now uh, for my coffee. If I have my coffee in here all day, I promise it'll stay hot the entire day. It's worth it's worth worth the investment, every penny of it. I have probably like three or four Yeti cups now because I get tired of the same color or because I leave them everywhere. Really, really recommend the Yeti cups. Um, you can use it for hot or cold. I have one of each. <laughs> this book I've been really, really liking. It's called Girl, Go Wash Your Face by Rachel Hollins. I don't know if you guys have heard about it. This book is amazing. Um, it, it especially targets women. I really like it, this book. It's almost my second time reading through it. I'm almost done with it for the second time around, and I plan on passing this book on to, to, uh, to some of my cousins. This book is amazing. Um, it, it's just I don't know she's so inspiring she motivates you she she teaches you life lessons just as a woman you know as a mom as a wife as a student as a as a you know as a as a boss woman anything she she can relate to so many women on so many different levels i really really recommend it it's more of a lifestyle book i can't wait she's actually got her next book coming out in march and i'm going to definitely pre-order it she is amazing and i really really recommend this book now two random things um they're pretty much i guess lifestyle <laughs> i'm going to talk to you guys about um is this coffee creamer it's the coffee may uh, italian sweet cream creamer they have this also in a sugar-free version for those of you guys who are watching your sugars or want lower calories but this creamer is amazing i actually had it for the first time at my aunt's house at my cousin's graduation and ever since then i've been so so obsessed with it if you haven't tried it go try it Another food favorite has been the Special K pumpkin spice cereal. I love pumpkin anything and everything. And this cereal is so good. Try it with almond milk. It's so good. Sometimes I have it for breakfast and even for dinner. It's so good. Go get some before. It's seasonal. So as soon as like fall time is over, they're going to switch over probably to like winter, uh, winter flavors. So go get your hands on this. Super, super good. 
And lastly, um, let me see. I'm gonna talk to you guys about these boots. These boots, I actually um, just picked them up from, from Nordstrom and I have them in black. I definitely wanted to get some um, brown ones just for, for the fall, but I've, I had the black ones since last year and they were my go-to booty. These are waterproof. They are so, so, so comfortable. I know um, during this time of the year, a lot of people like to travel. These are comfortable. You can travel with them. You can wear them with leggings. You can wear them with shorts. You can wear them with jeans. This looks good with anything and everything. And they are so, so comfy. And they're really, really cute. I really, really recommend them. Um, I don't remember how much they were, but they are definitely worth the investment. If I were to show you my black ones, they you can't even tell. I, I wore them all last year during this time of the year. So I really recommend them. And I think that pretty much um, sums up my my favorites for for fall for October. Um, I hope I hope you guys liked it. Please subscribe. Please give me a thumbs up and stay tuned for the next video. Thanks, guys.